man was waiting for Dougal, who seemed to be in a hurry. Oh, I got up so late this morning, I don't know whether I'm coming or going. You're going, old speedy mate, said Brian. I've got a million things to do, and I've not had time to put a comb through my hair yet. Yes, looks like it, said Brian. Bit shaggier than usual, if that's possible. <laughs> what? Choose your words, snail. It's true. You could do with having your barnet trimmed. What a vulgar expression. Yeah, well, I'm a vulgar snail. You can say that again. Well, get your hair cut, said Brian. I will, said Dougal, if I can find someone sufficiently sensitive. Someone who realises that I don't just want a quick top and tail. In short, in short, an artiste. Florence met Mr. Rusty, and they passed the time of day. Lovely day, said Florence. Beautiful, said Mr. Rusty. Like you. Oh, thank you, said Florence. Zebedee arrived. Late as usual, said Florence. You'll make me cry, said Zebedee. No, I won't, said Florence. She looked for Dougal and couldn't see him anywhere. Oh, I wonder where he is, she mused. She saw something. Never seen that before. I wonder what it is. There was a noise. Florence stopped and was amazed to see Dylan apparently working. Why, Dylan? Ma'am, welcome. Welcome to my hairdressing boutique, like, uh, like, uh, welcome. Are you, uh, like, comfortable, sir? Sir was Dougal. Uh, don't disturb the curlers, sir, until I use the setting lotion, said Dylan. Curlers, said Florence, aghast. Setting lotion? Sir, you really must keep still, or all my efforts will be ruined. Ruined, 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 like, uh, uh, ruined. <clears throat> mm, pardon me. Florence had never seen Dylan like this. He seemed quite agitated and distraught. Uh, perhaps you'd care to look, sir, he said. Sir looked. Can't see anything, he said. One needs to remove the towel, said Dylan. If you'll uh, just wait a moment, I'll take it off. Uh, yes, just a, just a finishing touch. Don't you dare, said Dougal. Florence pretended not to know who it was and said hello very politely. Hello, said Dougal. And Florence waited for something to happen. And something happened all right. Where are you going? You haven't finished yet, you... you rabbit, you! Florence found herself losing control. Er, uh, how do I look? said Dougal. Chic? Elegant? That's what I was promised. Have a look, said Florence. So Dougal looked. What's that sheep doing there? <laughs> oh, it's me. It's me. I'll sue him. I'll, 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 I'll bury his guitar. I'll, I'll, ooh, I'll, ooh, I'll, ooh. You wait till I find him. I'll make him rue the day he set foot in this garden. Savage. Call himself a hairdresser. He couldn't dress a football. Come back. Come back. <laughs> <laughs>